Hi guys, it's Jen. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be testing out the NARS All Day Luminous Lightweight Foundation. And this foundation claims to be a full coverage foundation. It claims to be for all skin types and it does say that you need to shake this up very well before using this foundation. I have the shade in Deville or Deville um, and it is light four. Um, so yes, I'm going to go ahead and jump into the demo and let you guys see me applying this to my face and then we will jump like kind of to me talking to you guys about what I think about the product. So my final thoughts on this foundation are not that good. I have wore this foundation one other time. I literally just wore it yesterday and I was in love with this foundation yesterday. Like I'm not kidding guys. Like if I had done a first, like a fully first impressions, I would have been like, you need to go buy this foundation, you know, but I just really today, I'm just not feeling this foundation. So I don't know if it truly was the foundation that I was loving yesterday or if it was the full coverage concealer that I was loving yesterday. Or maybe it was the brush that I used. It maybe blended it better. I, I really don't know. But today I'm not loving this foundation, guys. But I wanted to let you know what my thoughts were. Um, because your opinion on things can change and that's part of the reason why I am putting this video out. Because, like I said, if I had done just a full first impression, I would have been like, buy this foundation, it's $49, it's perfect, it's great, it's full coverage. And then, like, today, I'm just like, nope, it ain't full coverage, I don't like it. So, I'm going to be testing this foundation out a little bit more and just kind of seeing what works with it and what doesn't. Um, because yesterday, I, like I said, I was using a full coverage concealer. I did use kind of a colored setting powder, and today I didn't. I used a, like, white, like, translucent powder. I used the Ofra pressed powder. So I don't, I don't really think this was what made the difference because, like, literally, I didn't have to, like, yesterday, it just, like, went on seamlessly and blended beautifully. I don't know what the difference was today. Um, so yeah, and I did use the IT Cosmetics to cover my pimple that is on my face and I added a little bit to my chin because I wanted some more coverage. I didn't want my chin to be really bright and red. Um, so I, I don't know about this foundation guys. Like I said, um, please check the description box because I update you guys um, what my final thoughts are on the foundation, whether it is worth it or not. And this is a $49 foundation. That is a pricey foundation to not be 100% for sure if you like or not, or to go out and spend your money on. So please check my description box. I am going to be testing this foundation out for a full entire week, outside, inside, everything else you know, to let you guys like really know whether I like this and I like to do this for myself too. That way I know if I really want to keep a foundation or not. So until next time, bye guys. Don't forget to check that description box. Please subscribe and um, hit that little bell also. And I will also have my social media links down below for you guys if you want to go check out them and see me on social media. So until next time, bye guys.